one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Why does everyone look so sad? Why don't they travel together to keep each other company? Why is this place so grey? With trees, no grass? Why is the air so dirty? Isn't this something we can do? <laughs> air pollution is one of the biggest environmental concerns today as it can directly affect our health. The highest level of air pollution can be found in our towns and cities, caused largely by a cocktail of pollutants from vehicle exhausts. By making different travel choices, we can make a real contribution to improving local air quality. Choosing to walk, run or cycle instead of taking the car not only reduces the number of vehicles on our roads and the pollution emitted, but has the potential to deliver many other benefits such as lowering the risk of obesity, decreasing noise pollution and reducing the risk of accidents. Some people live in areas where air quality is much poorer than it should be. Tackling air pollution where it is worst and where people are most disadvantaged by it would enable many more people to live longer, healthier lives. Air quality can also be improved by creating more green spaces in our towns and cities, which help to remove certain pollutants from the air. This benefits overall health and well-being and supports sustainable living and working. And of course, all of these efforts to reduce air pollution will also help us to tackle climate change, as less pollution means fewer greenhouse gas emissions. A cleaner, healthier future doesn't need to be a dream. If we work together and look at things a little differently, just imagine the difference we can make. <laughs> <laughs>